Hello, welcome to ENT Video. We're at Abbey Road Studios to interview mastering engineer Sean McGee. It's purely mechanical and uh, in, in essence it hasn't changed really since they were scratching wiggly lines on wax cylinders and shouting into horns. In, in fact if we were cutting a silent groove in here and if you shouted loud enough to, at that you'd be able to um, hear the sound, it would come back at you. Oh really? So that would be cut into the record? Yeah, yeah. Oh. very quietly mind you, but um, I have had a band that uh, did that in their run out groove. All three of them stood around it and they screamed and uh, in the run out groove as it got to the end you could hear them going Rah. Yeah. In fact if you've got a paper cup and a pin, stuck the pin in the bottom of the cup, stuck that in the groove, you'd hear music. So we're going to cut a record? Uh, yes, why not? Right now? Let's do yeah. that. Yeah, well, I'll get you to hit go in a minute. Right, so uh, how it works is the, uh, the, the, the music is going to come out off the CD, it's going to go via a digital to analogue converter which is going to go into this, uh, into this desk. Um, a signal will be fed to the lathe and a delayed signal will be fed um, to the, the, the cutter head itself and then, then it will cut. So we're going to cut a seven inch. Um, so we stop the thing there, get it rolling like that and then do that and hit that button there. And in a minute, you'll watch this button light here. It'll start to flash and it'll come on. When it goes off, hit the button. When it goes off? Yep. Now hit the button. You're cutting a record. Now you can hear here, if I move my microphone here, noise, can you hear that? Well, is it slightly delayed? Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's six, uh, 667 milliseconds. Right. If we mute the speakers. You can hear the, um, what's coming out, out the cover head. There's the vocal. Yeah. yeah. So basically what you've got there is a stylus, a couple of coils, and it's doing this and up and down, cutting the record. So for every, uh, every movement left or right, up and down for phase. So volume and phase up and down. So it's, it's doing this. So you're having a groove that's not only swinging left and right, the base of it is going up and down as well. And that's it. Yeah, you do that, there you go, and then you press the fast button. You've got lateral movement, and then you've got uh, vertical movement, as you can see there where the, um, it's gone thinner and thicker. So you imagine it's a triangle. Mm, right. So the, 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 the deeper that dis the longer that distance is, the wider the thing's at the top. So you can see it's going deeper by the fact that it's, it's much wider at the top. And obviously, uh, long sweeping movements on lower frequencies. Mm. Little jagged ones are high frequencies. Right. It's just literally that. So you've got wavelength <laughs> and uh, you've got amplitude. Amplitude. So if we stick the um, needle on the record. Oh, okay, this, this, this is the playback. Yeah. And then... Uh, Unmute. Uh, we do that. 